Hurricane Patricia was downgraded to a tropical depression early Saturday as it passed over Mexico, dumping rains as it moved north toward Texas at about 21 miles an hour. The storm made records just a day earlier, when it had sustained winds of 200 miles per hour and gusts at as much as 250 miles per hour while still over the Pacific Ocean, making it the most powerful storm ever recorded in the Western Hemisphere. Footage captured in space showed the hurricane swirling closer to Mexico's Pacific coast. The U.S. National Hurricane Center estimated maximum sustained winds of 165 miles per hour when Patricia made landfall. The eye of the storm slammed into the coastline late Friday, about 120 miles south of the tourist city of Puerto Vallarta. So far, Mexican officials have reported no major damage, though heavy rains, which could cause landslides, are continuing to be a concern. The Mexican government says that thousands of people were evacuated from Puerto Vallarta on Friday in anticipation of the storm. Meteorologists at the National Hurricane Center say that as Patricia breaks up, remnants of its tropical moisture will likely contribute to the heavy rainfall that is already soaking Texas independently of the hurricane.